the situation. Yum. How to properly iron your clothes with a straightening iron. Hey, it works. So we're in like a staff only elevator, but then we just realized it's not an elevator. It's just like a floor. The floor moves. <laughs> we made it. So we set down our suitcases in the hostel, like in a little bar closet. <laughs> So we decided to stop and get some drinks. What'd you get, Maddie? Strawberry daiquiri. And I got a cocoa, what did I get? Colada. Cocoa colada. She stood up and just completely whacked her head. We need food so bad. So we're at Max getting some burgers. Look how bomb this looks. We made it back to our hostel. Back in the elevator, going up to our floor. Also, this time we have roommates. Last time we didn't. There's our floor, we're on our way. Here we are. This is our room. There's those two people's bunk beds. Here's our bunk beds. Out we go. I think we're going to climb this. We both took a nap and now we're up and Better going to <laughs> Yes. Going to walk. Also, look how good our view is. Ah oh, wow. Beautiful. Trash. That's a sad day. We got some ice cream with some churros. Mine has chocolate on it and hers has white chocolate and Oreo. We are just in the 7-Eleven and this guy complimented my shirt. We are back at our hostel. This little get together place below it. And now we must sleep. Good night. <laughs> Good morning. Look how cute she looks. Yes. Now we are going out. Everything will change one day. I got chicken and waffles, we got some french fries, and she got some pancakes. We just ate brunch, and now we are going to the castle. Maddie took a fat nap while I watched Netflix, and now we're going to eat at the Bronx. Oof. So we're sitting here and we have like a city view and this guy just gets pulled over right in front of us. Yummy, we both got the Bronx burger. We made it back to our hostel. Maddie changed into comfier clothes. I think we might just stay inside and watch like Netflix or something all night. I don't know yet. Good morning from our beautiful view in Copenhagen. We just booked another night in this hostel and our roommates left. So maybe we'll get new ones. It is going on 2.30 and we finally decided to get out of our hostel and go get some food. So we are at a place I don't know how to pronounce and we both got some chicken. We're back with the big balls. And then we went to the gas station, got a banana. Now we are going to get some smoothies. We walked to the smoothie. <laughs> we walked to the smoothie place, and I just kicked her off the street. <laughs> and it was closed, so now we are walking to a much unhealthier place, which is like milkshakes, I think, and ice cream. You know what's rude is when people compliment her. When I'm sitting right here, and he goes, "She's pretty." I was like, "Oh yeah, her. I know. Okay, I get it. I'm the ugly sister here." You don't have to tell me she's pretty. Tell her she's pretty. Holy shit. Look at these milkshakes. Oh my god. We just smashed these and they were so freaking good, but now we feel very, very fat. 
right now it is going on two o'clock in the morning and we're going to hang out downstairs by the bar because I have issues. So we came down to our hostel area and we just met a guy and he was super nice. Didn't get his name, but he subscribed to me. So if you're seeing this, hello. <laughs> Good morning. We both didn't get like any sleep. We went to bed at like four. We woke up, we got some smoothies, we ate a muffin, and they're super good. We're now shopping, and then I think we're headed back to the hostel after that. Finally made it back. Now we are at Momo Walk Bowl. What is it? Momo Walk Box. This looks fire. So we attracted some birds. They're eating some shrimp. <laughs> Got a banana and some Mentos. We've been stuck in Copenhagen for a couple days now and we have officially decided on a conclusion that the only thing to do here is eat. eat. So we're gonna go get a burger right down the street. We're back at Bronx Burger and we are going to be splitting some food. <laughs> she just goes, look at all those scooters. I go, those aren't scooters. <laughs> she goes, exactly, they weren't chickens. Oh. My gosh. It's a beautiful Friday night, so you know what that means? Go out. Just kidding, it means go sit on some steps and people watch for the night. Nice. Earlier on situation, there is a bee alarm to the personal. We have an emergency situation at the moment and everybody must leave the building by following the exit signs. So there's a fire in our building. What is the key? It's downstairs. And bring further information about the situation. So our hostel caught on fire. We were evacuated. Yeah, and she's looking fire. But we're evacuated. Now we just have to wait for all these vehicles to leave in order to go back in. We decided to come get a drink. Make ourselves cozy. Just watch some pretty flashing lights everywhere. We're good. We're cleared to go back inside. It's currently 4.45 and Maddie and I both can't sleep and the sun is rising. <laughs> it's already risen and our roommates are passed out. We have no idea what's going on, but this bell will not stop. It's been going off for like 10 minutes. So we didn't really get like any sleep, but now we are up walking to a place I believe is called Grod. It has like oatmeal bowls and like smoothie bowls. We laid down and we watched movies for a very long time and now we are going to find those big balls again and then take pictures next to them. The guy in the restaurant came over and just gave us some flower petals. It was so cute. Look how amazing this looks. The owner just came over and gave us some free wine, so that's a plus. Good morning, it's 4.30 and we have to walk a mile to the train station with these bad boys. We're off to the US. 